Hi everybody and welcome to episode 89. We've just come back from defeating Yolgoth. I've placed his head on the statue already. And we're going to melt some black metal. Because we've got quite a bit here. Oh, pardon me. And I need to replenish my <clears throat> my stores of everything. So let's put the metal back. Yeah, we we had a hell of a lot of death. So yeah, basically took a shortcut through there put his head and then we came home so yeah was a long journey back but as you can see lots of death these are finally uh, finished baking And I still need to get stuff to build the. Uh, the. what you call it? The. oven. I'm actually quite tired. It was a long drive back. Okay, what do we actually need for the oven? Let's just check here. Iron, stone, and cores. Okay. Well, we've got that. We don't have too much iron left, but we do have it. Let's do that. Uh, what's the difference? Uh, one's... Okay. Game just been difficult as well. Uh, we need stone. 20 of them. We even managed to get some locks pelts. So we're going to... Locks. Heads, which are short for trophies. Hey, this thing is slow. Okay. Uh, we need iron, we said, right? There, iron. Might as well get the cores while I'm standing here. Yeah, okay, I knew exactly how many cores I wanted. Yeah, I even made a second windmill just to get the the barley process quicker. Completely forgot, forgetting I need the, the oven as well. Okay. 
Okay. Put the gold in there so we're not carrying the gold around. Yo, 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 that's so close to limit. I see I didn't even bother replanting the the whatchamacallit? Artisan bench. Oh, we need to go fetch the artisan bench. This is probably going to push me overweight now. No, it's not. We're just going to pop the stove right over here. Right there? No. Okay, this needs to go back inside, and we've also got the thingy for the wisps, the wisps for killing the boss. We obviously got that when we got the, uh, what you gonna call it? The tar. Okay, so now we need another 10 stone. I don't know why I'm getting all this stone, but we've got plenty here. Okay, we just need six. Wait, I can make three wisp towers, so I might as well... Use them. Let's place them here. I need the stone cutters bench, but we've got one here. Uh -huh. There we go. So let's put the wisps. What do you have to say? Oh, I didn't even get a chance to speak to it. So now that we've got the wisps going, I'm killing that boss. So yeah, sorry, I was just reading that. So we can now just go put this bench back. Now when night time comes, the wisps will come. And I'll be able to have that cool little glow that kitty had. And she helped me kill the dragon. See, our wolves are being super friendly with each other. But this enclosure is a bit too small for them. These are all health potions. Okay, so we take the flower and then we, we throw it in here. 
Not a cookable item. What do I do with the flower then? Uh, we don't have the cooking pot upgraded, do we? Pots and pans. Black metal, copper and iron. Okay. So let's put that back. Oh, well, we've got quite a bit of black metal. I don't know why, I want to call it star metal, but I think that's because of New World. Okay, what was the other requirement? Copper. Found wood and iron. Yeah, we've got like a whole wagon full of copper. From when I last gathered, but we do need some fine wood. We need 10. And we need to go get another stack of iron. We do need to go and do a crypt run because like I'm actually literally hustling for iron right now. Which is not the way things should be done. Not in my base anyway. Okay, so I've got enough to craft it. And the question, where is it going to want to snap? There we go. Bread dough, uh, there we go. Learn something new. So we've got bread dough. Oh, okay, it takes quite a bit. So we go here. Bread dough. Ten barley each. So we need to go and get more of our stuff. So we've got 10. Okay, so I can't put lots in there. Now it's just a matter of waiting, I guess. So I can only put four in at a time. It's a little bit sad. What was the other new recipes? Uh, unbaked lox pie. There we go, it sounds like that's now cooked. And now we can make bread of our own. No longer need Kitty to make other bread for us. Now we can do it ourselves. Pretty straightforward and easy. And bread has a nice buff to it. 
but I want to make more of these wolf skewers. We don't have too much on the food side, but potions we seem to be good. Okay, so as you can see, it's not getting dark. We're going to go check on those wisps. I didn't want to go too far while we're waiting for this bread, though. So. Yeah, where, where'd I put that dough? There should be two more. I wish it was a bit of like a search item, but... Okay, I don't know what I did with the dough. If I just click it... Uh, ah, I placed it in there already. <laughs> Okay. Let's go get us. Uh, wait, was that it? Saying it's finished? Yeah. So, we now got our bread. Let's go have a quick little squiz at the wisps. See if any wisps will come. So there's no wisps as yet. The wisp fountain, the wisps are coming. They only come, uh, there we go, there's one. Where'd he go? There's the wisp floating around the the shrine. So you're meant to be able to harvest it. There we go. Haha, oh, I got a wisp light. And if memory serves, you need to come and craft it here at. Oh, yeah. Hi. Forgot about this. Gotta craft the wisp light. At the forge? Didn't think it was at the forge. No. I'm clearly missing something. I've got the wisp. Ah, wisp light, there we go. One silver. There we go, we now got the wisp light. <clears throat> so what the wisp light does is when you go to the mist land, right? It allows you to see further. You can see now I've got this cool little glow that shines around me. And it guides like my, my light. But when you're in the mist lands, then that extends the much further but yeah making good progress good progress and I need to work out where we can find the mist lands Uh, and I wanted to show you the difference between the, the whatchamacallits. So now that I've unlocked it, and we do have a, not a lot of tar, but we do have some tar. So we go like that, grab some wood. Let 
We're not meant to be taking that wood though. So basically, I'm just going to put it here. This gives like a nice shingle effect versus a normal thatch roof. You can't see it just yet. Give the game a second. See it? There's the light coming in. <laughs> Serves me right. Okay, while I wait for the light, I'm just going to put this XX tile away. Uh, how's our torches looking? We were gone for a long time. See, now we can pretty much go on limits to supply wolf meat, but I don't want to hurt my wolves. I think they're cute. And there's, a, there's like a 10% a chance that the wolf will actually upgrade to a one-star wolf. But their enclosure is a bit too small for them. I need to make the enclosure bigger for them to keep breeding. Okay, there we go. So basically, still can't see it 100%. But you get a cool shingle. Oh, there comes the light. You can see it in the, sh the shadow coming down the hill. Down the, the side of the base. So this one gives like a cool little shingle effect. There you go, you can see it there. Instead of just the normal thatch roof, but I actually quite like the thatch roof. What I like to do with this one is actually the beams. The beams are way nicer. Oh, there you go. Now you can see it properly. Uh... So yeah, they've got that like effect. But like I said, I quite enjoy the art style on the on the on these pieces to, for decoration purposes. You'll notice in a lot of my builds, I'll actually do more of those than normal wood. And also, we've got the this little frame piece which makes good for windows combine that with the the, the, the crystal walls they actually come out quite nice if you do it correctly but we're not going to do any of that right now So yeah, but now that we are home, things have progressed nicely for us. Uh, contemplated making this a little bit larger for the wolves. See, so it's not so much to keep them from wandering; like they can't get out, actually get out of my base. It's just to protect them from when their base gets attacked. Now, I do want them to keep breeding. So, yeah. 
we've pretty much unlocked everything. We just gotta get the marble from the dwarves. Uh, and we need to craft this one. Uh, but we don't have enough iron. Because I want the iron nails. Okay, so in the, in the next video we will be doing an iron run. We've got a few crypts we can visit. Uh, like we know we didn't finish that one down there. I saw it when we were carrying on. We found two new mines up there. Yeah, those are a bit of a run. And we have to do all these little... Uh, mini dungeons as well. I was thinking of doing that one, but oh, I wasn't in the mood when we... after killing that boss. So yeah. Uh, yeah, we were going to make two sets of bronze screws, bronze nails, iron nails, I'm almost saying bronze. Like that. Then I think we needed fine wood. Yeah, eight fine wood. This is just to give ourselves a little bit of organization. Uh, 8, 16, 24. I needed to quickly count there. My brain wasn't working. Okay, so can't see which way oh, it's facing the right way. So now that that's built, we can take this here. All the old armor sets that I've collected. And we do this one, two, three. I never actually finished the The other set, though. Uh, there. Ah, oh, they need to be turned around. No, right, give me back my hammer. So I place them back to front. Okay, so that little knobby piece must actually be at the back, not in the front. And realizing that I'm trying to connect
the thing backwards does not help my situation. See, I never farmed the abominations to get the full root set. But it looks pretty cool. And as you saw, we can actually equip uh, weapons to them. Like so. Uh, but we're not going to... I don't think we've got any more weapons. Like that. <laughs> Yeah, it's literally just a quick, quick pick of all your different gear. Like I was storing them previously on the walls in this base, like so. So we just take that, like that. Seems I broke something there. So what I do is I'll take this one off. Yeah, I'm messing myself up, yeah. Ah, oh, it's not what I wanted. Like that. And I give him the bronze one. I can't can't put any more on them. Oh, okay, it's gotta sit on the back. That makes sense. that <clears throat> so you can make little mannequins basically but yeah we don't need any of those right now we still have four more arrows but yeah I want to say guys thanks for watching this video I know I was just tinkering around the base, but we made some good good progress. And I shall see you in the next one.